Smiling and sprightly in the spring sunshine with her husband by her side, the Princess of Wales is clearly getting back to her best in a scene that will delight millions in Britain and around the world. The first footage of Kate Middleton since her abdominal surgery in January also puts to bed concerns about her health and discredits bizarre and baseless conspiracy theories being spread about her online. And Prince William couldn't hide his delight at being back out and about with his wife after a clearly challenging two months of recovery. Body language expert Judy James has told Mail Online that Kate was exuding body confidence and showed no frailty, in an appearance that was deliberately reassuring fans and quashing all the toxic rumors swirling around her. She said, Kate walks ahead of William, taking large enough strides to suggest no hint of any ongoing frailty. While William keeps his face partially hidden under his cap and his head lowered, Kate's body language here suggests a desire to be seen. This is quite extraordinary body language behavior for a leading royal out incognito in public and it suggests a point is, quite naturally, being made in terms of reassuring fans and quashing all the toxic rumors. Her head is up and her long hair is billowing while she wears a cheek-rounded smile that seems to signal she is completely upbeat and cheerful. Judy added, It is completely stunning to see the most sought-after woman in the world and the subject of speculation and rumors on social media suddenly appearing like this looking not just healthy, full of energy and incredibly happy but also making no apparent attempt to hide while out in public. Kensington Palace has not commented on the film where Kate strides from the Windsor farm shop, much loved by the couple and set up by William's late grandfather Prince Philip, while carrying a substantial shopping bag on Saturday afternoon. The future queen looked well and was sportily dressed, wearing a hooded top, gym leggings, sports socks and trainers. She smiled repeatedly as she spoke to the Prince of Wales, who appeared to be equally happy to be out and about with his wife in the spring sunshine. William was also casual in a baseball cap, casual coat, jeans and trainers. The couple had gone there for supplies having reportedly spent the morning watching their three children, George, 10, Charlotte, 8, and Louis, 5, play sport. Kate and William were not accompanied by their three children. The couple have, in recent weeks, been left deeply distressed by wild social media speculation and gossip about Kate's health and whereabouts. This has since been reported by publications ranging from the New York Times to British Vogue, and even become the subject of cruel mockery on primetime American television. Global superstars such as Kim Kardashian have added fuel to the fire with posts about Kate's disappearance to their millions of fans. The debacle over the princess well-meaning Mother's Day photograph, which she later admitted to having tried to edit, only added to the swirl of speculation. This was preceded by William's sudden announcement he was pulling out of his godfather's memorial service last month on what was only described as a personal matter just 45 minutes before he had been due to give a reading. A 
Against the backdrop of the king's cancer diagnosis, the drama has created a febrile atmosphere of gossip and conjecture around the royal family. Sources close to the whales have told the mail they have found the speculation hugely hurtful and hard to deal with, but were determined to focus on what was important to them, their family and the princess recovery. It comes amid reports that Kensington Palace is working with PR gurus to devise a Kate's schedule when she returns to work. Her new private secretary Lieutenant Colonel Tom White and William's private secretary Ian Patrick are believed to be part of a senior team working around the clock after outlandish rumors swirled around her absence from the public eye, the Mirror reports. A source told the publication, the teams are working round the clock to devise the Princess of Wales's back-to-work plan after weeks of immense pressure. They all know that the world will be watching after weeks of heightened speculation and often outlandish commentary on social media. It is anticipated that the new image, showing the couple going about their normal lives, will go some way to calming many of the wilder rumors that have gripped people across the globe. The snap was taken at 12.43 p.m. on Saturday by a member of the public who was also at the farm shop, just a mile's drive from the Wales Adelaide Cottage home, on their Apple iPhone 12 Pro phone. The person concerned said they were visiting the shop to kill time while on the way to meet someone to buy an item from Facebook when they recognized William and Kate and were struck by how happy they looked. They spotted the couple again in the car park and decided to capture the moment to share with their own delighted family. When I went inside I looked around and noticed them. They all looked happy, the person, who wishes to remain anonymous, said. To be honest I don't follow this type of news but I shared, it, with my family. They were like oh, she's alive. He told TMZ. I noticed a couple choosing loaves of bread and the woman turned her face and I felt like I had seen the face before. It was familiar. I went to my car and as they came out of the shop I just filmed them. I think they walked out through a gate out of the grounds. They just vanished and I didn't see a car. Kate looked happy and relaxed. They look happy just to be able to go to a shop and mingle. Kate looked relieved, like it was a success going to a shop. It felt natural. The prince and princess are both dressed casually, each carrying a white shopping bag in their left hand. Kate sports black leggings, tucked into socks and trainers, with a zip-up top and is wearing her hair loose. William is wearing blue jeans, trainers and a jacket with a baseball cap pulled low down over his forehead. As they chat, the pair, who will celebrate 13 years of marriage in April, couldn't look happier. And the fact that the princess seems to be walking with such ease suggests that she is very much on the mend.
On January 17, Kensington Palace announced that Kate had been admitted to the London Clinic in Marylebone, central London, the previous day for planned abdominal surgery. It said the operation had been successful but would result in a two-week stay in hospital before a period of lengthy recuperation at home. Her spokesman added that, based on the current medical advice, she was unlikely to return to public duties until after Easter. That advice has not changed. A spokesman stated that it was the princess' personal wish to keep her medical information private and said it would only provide an update if there were significant new information to share. However their clear statement failed to stop social media and overseas publications, websites and television from speculating wildly about the princess' whereabouts and what may have happened to her. The hashtag hashtag where I skate began trending. Even the BBC website tackled the issue, highlighting the outlandish speculation under the title. Royal Dilemma as Public Curiosity Over Kate's Health Grows Some of it has been farcical, including the much-repeated rumor that she is recuperating from a Brazilian bum lift or hiding away after a bad haircut. Other claims, however, have been downright offensive including that made by a journalist on Spanish television that she has been in a coma that gained huge international traction and had to be openly denied by Kensington Palace. However trolls and conspiracy theorists have continued used her absence and the lawlessness of social media to spread deeply sinister and highly libelous claims to this day. A spokesman recently reiterated their previous advice that they were not going to provide a running commentary on the princess' health. From our perspective, we were very clear from our statement at the start of this in January that the Princess of Wales planned to be out of public action until after Easter and that hasn't changed, they said.